This is the fastest way to mow grass, a walk-behind mower equipped with a cage wheel caddy. With its front-mounted deck, the walk-behind is extremely maneuverable. It gets into tight spaces and mows closer to trees and objects, reducing the need for string trimming. Cage innovation is not just about selling products. We are about helping you, like sharing our 27 years of field experience and boldly challenging the way you are doing things. For instance, Cage's parent, Horticulture Services Company, has resisted the trend toward the zero turn or the stand on mower. The walk behind is faster and better, and here's why. Without time consuming maneuvering to make the 180 degree turn, this is what happens when a ZTR reverses direction at the end of a mowing stripe. Ew, show that again. Now make that turn 20 to 30 times a year in the same spot. A walk behind causes a less scuffing and rutting when making sharp turns. The operator easily makes a scuff-free 180 degree turn without excessive maneuvering. On commercial sites like these, this adds up to faster overall mowing times as compared to zero turn riders or stand-on models. ZTRs are also inferior to walk behinds when mowing around evergreen trees. Because the ZTR deck is mounted in the middle, it is virtually impossible to mow close to the branches without damage. The branches are scuffed by the machine or actually driven over. The only remedy is to stay back, greatly increasing string trimming. Shown here is the walk behind front mount deck. Notice how the deck mows under the branches without damage. Same thing with shrub beds. The walk behind noses well under the branches, but the ZTR is abusive to shrubs and the operator. Watch how fast the operator guides the walk behind around these trees without jockeying or threatening the tree. But this is just plain ugly. The walk behind holds a straight line on a slope better than a heavier mower, and the sulky allows the operator to step off momentarily if needed. The ZTR can't hold this simple slope going downhill or up. Why use a mower that can't be used everywhere on the site? Same thing with a stander. Can't hold the slope, so into the pond we go. Watch the incredible traction of the walk behind. The operator can quickly raise the walk behind deck. This is handy driving over mulch beds without disengaging the blades or during turns to avoid blowing clippings where they would cause a mess. Operators driving a walk behind are more likely to stop to pick up trash or do other detailing because it is so easy to hop on and off. This is less likely with a ZTR because the operator has to do too much just to leave his seat. Is sitting down while mowing more comfortable than standing? Actually, many commercial cutters prefer standing to sitting. Also, from the customer's perspective, workers that are standing appear to be working harder than those that are sitting. Oh no, does he still work here? Whoops, that serves him right. Now clean it up. The sulky attached to the walk behind mower must be of equal quality to the mower or the overall productivity is lost. Most sulkies have low end non tapered wheel bearings which don't even last one full season. The wheels begin to wobble after only a few hours and the bearings require the mess of daily greasing. The Caddy's tapered roller bearings are similar to those found on highway trailers and they will last a lifetime. The Caddy 360 model reduces operator fatigue with its unique suspension feature. A comfortable operator is a more productive operator. Also, without suspension, the bouncing of the operator is transferred to the mower wheels and deck causing uneven mower tracking and a rippled scalping effect. Cage's suspension virtually eliminates all such bouncing. Next, watch how quickly the caddy detaches from the mower with its quick-release coupler. No tools or greasy pins. The cage wheel caddy is the first mower sulky designed with the comfort of the operator's feet in mind. 
The ridge in the middle of the slip-resistant platform keeps the operator's feet apart. Very important for day-long comfort and productivity. The height at which the Sulky is mounted varies significantly between mower brands. To compensate, the wheel caddy platform features an adjustable pitch. Without pitch adjustment, the platform will be tilted too far forward or too far backward. The position of the control levers also varies between walk-behind models. Check this out. The new Caddy Model 360 features full circle pivoting for easy backing up. Customers asked for this option and we delivered. Now it's even easier to back out of the trailer or away from obstacles. No binding or scuffing. Observe the Caddy's secure and durable mounting bracket. The Cage Wheel Caddy comes in two models, the 250 and the 360. One of these is sure to fit your budget. The Cage Wheel Caddy will improve mowing productivity and increase your profits. The Wheel Caddy is unique, with innovative features not seen anywhere in the market. U-joints, trailer bearings, suspension and platform adjustability all add up to low maintenance and operator satisfaction. The Wheel Caddy is built to last. To order one, log on or call today.